Hello everyone. Now, I am at Futami Okitama Shrine in Ise City, Mie Prefecture. I'm here to see the sunrise from Miyotoiwa. The moving sunrise seen from between Miyoto rocks. The sky and sea change moment by moment with the brilliance of the sun. And in the distance, the figure of sacred Mount Fuji appears. I enjoy the sun slowly showing its face. Have fun with you too. The morning sun comes out little by little. It is a very divine experience. This is a gift for you. Futami Okitama Shrine is a Shinto shrine situated in Ise City, Mie Prefecture. It is known as a separate shrine of Ise Jingu. Futami Okitama Shrine is famous for its association with marriage and harmony between couples and the happiness of families. Its origins are rooted in Japanese ancient mythology. This shrine symbolizes the bond between spouses and families. One of the prominent features of the shrine is the Miyoto rocks. This is regarded as a symbol of the bond between husband and wife. Next I will go to Issei Jingu. I will take the train there. This house is Hinjitsuken. This house was built in 1887. It was used as a resting place and lodging for honored guests. The road leading to the shrine is called Sando. There are many historic shops and inns along this road. It's fun to walk while looking at it. I arrived at Futami no Ura station. There are few trains. When you use it, you have to check it well. The scenery of the countryside station is wonderful. I feel that time is slowing down.
I arrived at Issei Shi Station. It's still 8 o'clock in the morning, so there aren't many people. I will walk from the station to Issei Jingu. 10 minutes walk to Issei Jingu. The road to the shrine is beautifully paved. There are restaurants, cafes and souvenir shops here. But it's still early in the morning, so the shops aren't open yet. Arrived at Issei Jingu. At Issei Jingu, there are Naiku and Geku. It is better to start from this Geku. Geku is left hand traffic. Please wash your hands at the Temazuya. In Japan, this ceremony is a sign of respect. It is done to purify the hands before entering the sacred space. When entering a shrine in Japan, it is customary to perform a bow as a sign of respect. By performing this act, you show reverence to the spirits and traditions of the shrine. In Japan, you don't walk in the middle of a shrine road. Because it is considered to be a place where the deity pass. Geku is dedicated to Toyo Uke no Omi Kami. The Shinto deity responsible for food, agriculture, and industry. It is believed to have been established over 2000 years ago. And has since been rebuilt every 20 years. It is a ceremonial practice, Shikinin Sengu. The architecture of Geku follows the traditional Japanese style. It characterized by thatched roofs and unpainted wood structures. Many people come to offer prayers for bountiful harvests. They are deeply appreciative of prosperity and happiness. At Issei Jingu, you are basically not allowed to make personal wishes. You give thanks for being alive. You can also wish for world peace. Deity values gratitude and consideration for others. In Japanese Shinto, it is said so. This space is called, Kodenchi. This place is used for, Shikinin Sengu. A shrine is entirely rebuilt and transferred. And a new location every two decades. Shikinin Sengu is a significant event in the Shinto calendar. And many worshippers visit in search of the enshrined deity.
This is Kazenomiya. It enshrines the deity of wind. This is Suchinomiya. It enshrines the deity of earth. This rock resembles Jizo. He will be happy if you pet him gently. It's hard to find him. If you find him, pet him gently. This is Takanomiya. It enshrines Aramitama of Toyo Uke no Omakami. Aramitama is a fierce and brave divine spirit. According to Shinto mythology, the provision of food, agriculture, and industry. She is believed to be a divine figure responsible. Amaterasu Omakami said, I can't eat slowly by myself. So call the deity of food, Toyo Uke no Omakami, near me. It is said that it came to be enshrined in Geku. Toyo Uke no Omakami is venerated as a protector and provider of abundant food, ensuring successful harvests and the well-being of the people. Worshippers offer prayers 
and they appreciated the rich agricultural bounty. Shinto is a traditional religion in Japan that holds significant cultural and spiritual importance for the Japanese people. In Shinto, there are things that are important. Family and community ties, purity and beauty of life. Not only that, we value a deep respect and harmony with nature. It is deeply rooted in Japanese history and culture. It contributes to Japanese identity and pride. It is said that many Japanese people are non-religious. However, many people have Shinto integrated into their lives. It transcends religious boundaries and is rooted in everyday life. So many people think that people's moral ideas are upheld. Chicken and Sangu is being held at this shrine. In this way, we will rebuild next to the current location. The god is moved to a newly built place and enshrined there. In Japan, there is a traditional job called Miyadaiku. Miyadaiku is to pass on traditional techniques to future generations. Shikin and Sangu is considered a very important event. This camphor tree stands along Omet Sando in Geku. When Tairano Kiyomori visited here, a branch on the west side was cut because it touched Kiyomori's crown. That's the same. The tree is said to be close to 1,000 years old. It looks like there are two trees, but it is actually a single large tree.
This is the end of the Geku visit. It took about 90 minutes to visit each shrine. It's fun to visit the shrine while researching its history. From now on, I'm going to visit Naiku. It takes an hour to walk. So I go by bus. A video of the Naiku will be introduced in the next video. Please look forward to. Please comment what you think of the video. Please subscribe to the channel and give it a high rating. Bye for now.